guys, F5 of the card guys, bringing you guys another quick break. Today, I've got a Upper Deck Series 1 2020-2021 tin. I like how they covered McDavid's face here. Um, this is from EB Games of all places. And a little bit of a backstory here. I got very lucky because when I went to the store, I asked them if they had any hockey cards and they said they don't, but they'll check. And turns out they had one tin locked up in a little shelf somewhere with all the rest of the used games. So this was the one and only tin that they had in their store. So whether or not that's a good omen, I don't know. But we're going to find out because that's what we do here at the card guys. First and foremost, you'll notice that we've started to upgrade the background a little bit. You know, we've got card stands here. I've got a couple card stands here ready just in case we pick up anything awesome. I got the top loaders ready on the side here. And we've upgraded the book of Pedersen. He is now in a one touch. So these things are super hard to get. Um, I actually paid a lot of shipping just to get it. Don't know if it was worth it. I might have been drunk when I did it. But I digress. It's upgraded, guys. We have the book of Pedersen. All right, so hopefully he brings us some good luck. This is the debut of the fully opened book of Pedersen. If this doesn't work, we might have to go back to something else. Um, coming up, we do have some more stuff to open. We have another box of SP Authentic 1819 hiding in the back. I may have just made another impulse purchase, but uh, we'll see. We do have an eBay store, so if you guys want to buy some of the stuff that we have, uh, we're going to put it on sale soon. Uh, you'll probably see that Travis Dermott up there, that 001 out of 999 that we pulled in our last video. Uh, you might see that one online soon. And um, no, we're probably not going to put any Pedersons out there. Anyway, we do have Pokemon too. Uh, we might dive into the world of Pokemon because... I know nothing about Pokemon, but we might bring in an expert because we need somebody like that. And they might become a new card guy. Anyway, to it. Here we go. Let me rip open this tin. If I can. I probably should have brought my trusty assistant with me. I thought this uh, cellophane wrap would be a lot easier than it is. But um, apparently I don't have enough muscles to rip open cellophane, guys. This is uh, quite disappointing. All right, while I do that, I've got a nice, cool-looking can of beer here called the Hot Box IPA. That is trippy. All right. You see that X? Now that, I've, now that I've made you all dizzy, let's get to it. That was just a distraction so that I can open this box, or cellophane, I should say, to get to the tin. All right. It's a nice-looking tin, guys. Very nice-looking tin. Uh, I've bought a couple of Series 2 tins from 1920. They didn't give me any good luck. Um, that's why we swore off 1920 going forward. But here's the tin for 2021. Uh, let's get into it. Let's see how many packs we're going to get here. So we got five on one side. And now, so there should be another five. Oh, no, four. Sorry, you get four and this uh, OPG glossy pack. All right. Uh, maybe I'll open the glossy pack first. But uh, if you watched the last video on how to hunt for inserts, let's see if this actually works, if there's any sort of thick packs. Hmm. As you can see, they've actually changed the design a bit now on these ones. You can't even see anything here. The uh, logos and everything are bottom here, and the serial numbers are here, but you can't even see it on the side anymore. So maybe it only works for gravity feeds. All right, so there goes my theory. All right, OPG Glossy. Let's do this. No tap for this one. Here we go. We got a Martin Kaut Glossy Rookie. Followed by a Martin Kelt Glossy Rookie Gold. Followed by Josh Norris. All right. I know a lot of Senators fans are really high on this kid. 
And for good reason, this kid looks uh, absolutely amazing. Uh, he's got huge potential behind him. So hopefully uh, the Wolves of the Senators are going to be behind him now. First pack. You know what? Let's tap. First pack magic. Let's debut the book of Pedersen. Here we go. Bring us some luck. Uh, doesn't look like we got anything, but here we go. Kempe, Marino, Riley Smith. Oh, we got something. Matt Zuccarello, Gabe Velarde. Wow, look at that. The book of Pedersen works. All right, I take it back. We did get something. This was the guy that uh, Vancouver supposedly wanted, or at least all the fans here were crying over when we drafted Pedersen instead of Gabe Velarde. And there's that infamous video of the guy calling him the next Jonathan Taves. Zach Sanford, Blake Wheeler, and Timo Meyer. All right. Good start so far. All right. We're going to set Mr. Velarde here on his new pedestal. All right. Next pack. I'm going to sense this is a base pack, so I won't do the Pedersen tap. You know, you can't have one big hit after another. The card guys just don't get such kind of luck. So let's do this instead. Here we go. Darnell Nurse, Kerfoot, Kadri, Ehlers, Portraits of Ovechkin. All right, so that is kind of a hit. Stahl, Pasta, and Horvat. Uh, yeah, there you go. So at least it wasn't a base pack. Now this one definitely is a base pack, right? Because you can't have three packs with hits in a row, right? That's just unheard of. You've seen enough of my videos to know that I don't get that kind of luck. And if you haven't seen enough of my videos, now you know. Anisimov, Coleman, Johansson, Strom, Carlson, Killorn, Riley, and Bjorkstrand. See, there you go. And usually when you get one base pack, you're going to get a second base pack. This one feels suspiciously thin, actually. But uh, let's give it a shot here, boys and girls. Fox, Sagan, oh, a jersey card of Mark Shifley, huge, okay, Bennington, Brandon Carlo, and a checklist, so that's why it was suspiciously thin, because there's only five cards plus the jersey card, all right, uh, but I'll take it, Mark Shifley jersey card, next pack, You got a Gusev, Quinn Hughes, Truba, Leon Dreisaitl. That's a nice picture of Dreisaitl. I'm pretty sure I have this one somewhere. But Boone Jenner, Ryan Suter, McAvoy, and Brandon Saad. So far, Velarde is the hit of the pack. So uh, let's do another tap. Let's see. The Book of Pedersen. You got Philip Dano, Semyon Verlamov, Rocco Grimaldi, and Peyton Krebs. Man, the book of Pedersen. All right, I did not plan it this way, guys, but the book of Pedersen has shown up, guys. Peyton Krebs and Gabe Velarde in the same tin. All right. Well, there's still one more slot there. There's still one more stand, so maybe we're going to get another young gun. I don't know, but here we go. Drew Doughty. Noah Hannafin, Carter Hart, and Christian Dvorak. No tap for this one. You can't over tap. That's the other rule of the rule of the Book of Pedersen. You just can't overuse your tap. Otherwise, it doesn't mean as much when you do it. But watch, this might have a Lafreniere in it just because I said that. We got Wierenski. We got, looks like we've got ourselves a Dazzler coming up. Lindholm, Subban, Dazzler, Nick Suzuki. Yellow Dazzler, Nick Suzuki. I know a lot of Montreal fans will be happy with this one. There you go. Nick Suzuki, Yellow Dazzler. Pajot, Zaitsev, Eller, and Morgan Riley. Whew, this has been a pretty good tin so far, guys. We have like a 33% chance or 
actually, it's, I think it's actually a 25% chance of pulling one more young gun. So let's see what happens. I'm going to do a last tap on the book of Pedersen. So we won't open, uh, we'll open this pack without the tap. You got Larkin, Gerard, Hyman, Klingberg, Vetrano, Schmidt, Goligoski, and Zach Cassian. All right, so all base. That's when you got to charge up. Tap the book of Pedersen. And here we go. All in on the book of Pedersen, guys. All in. We can do this. Or I can do this. You won't get the best of me, Pack. You won't get the past best of me, Rapper. Let's do this. Here we go. Orlov, Shen, Pareko, Jacob Verana. All right, so that's the hit there, Verana. Kirby Doc, Will Butcher, Thatcher Demko, and Danton Heinen. So Pedersen got us uh, one of his teammates and nice looking Kirby Doc as well as the Jacob Verana. So at least it wasn't a base pack. All right, to recap, guys, we got Jacob Verana, we got Nick Suzuki. Yellow Dazzler, we've got Leon Dreisaitl, we got a game jersey of Mark Shifley, portraits of Alex Ovechkin, these glossy OPG rookies, and then our two big young guns. We got Peyton Krebs and Gabe Velarde. All right, so what do you guys think? The Book of Pedersen, yay, nay? I think it's a strong yay. This thing has been amazing for us. And now that we've opened it up like this, I think we're unleashing its full potential. I can't wait till we open more packs with it. But hey guys, I really appreciate everything you guys have done. All the subscriptions, all the likes, all the comments. We do our best to get back to all of them. And you know what? It means a lot that uh, we've come so far. So as always with us, you know, stay healthy, stay safe. Uh, keep fighting the good fight. Keep doing what you're doing. Uh, we appreciate everything. And finally, drink to that if you can. Get dizzy with this. Cheers, guys. Oh, oh, oh.